Lamar DeRozan and Rihanna, and they need more than even Rihanna. 4-73 lead, Rihanna moving and moving. It's a good move Rihanna has, huh, PJ? You didn't think he'd be a pillow for their feet. Come on, man. Yeah. <laughs> I bet my 17-year-old daughter, DJ Kyle Korver. Props a performance like that. Season high. Um, you know, I, I watched a lot of Instagram. I see you singing last night. So, you know, kind of hope we out a little bit of the motivation. Uh, yeah, I just want to yeah. It's uh, El Salvador this weekend in a friendly at uh, FedEx Field. I asked Luis Scola if he knew that Messi was going to be here. here. He said, I gave him the ticket. on NBC Sports California and the My Teams app brought to you by your Northern California. Hey, I'm gonna have to go over and say he's hey, right there. Sir. So this is where you are and that's where my face is. Yep, up here getting in Stu Wiener. <laughs> and now you're close. It's not working out. He has no idea. Was talking about how much they love Queen Latifah oh. because they were talking about the movie Hustle, which was outstanding. Like, we, we, like we know, like sometimes you say it, but it's like. Very far off the court, as you can see, the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge, Will and Kate, as you just heard, attending their first NBA game, and it's part of a new partnership between the NBA and the Royal Foundation just announced today the new project will unite NBA players.
Are you enjoying this Hawks game, even though we're kind of struggling up here? Oh, yeah, it's really good. I had a good time, and the popcorn is very pottery. Let me ask you this also. Let's get your uh, music up. Are you performing in Los Angeles?